Hi friends, welcome to the tutorial of computer graphics programming with OpenGL. Uh, today we will learn about the uh, orthographic projection uh, with respect to the window. In the previous tutorial, if you see, we have used orthographics projection with respect to the window that is 640 according to the pixel value. That is what is our window size. Uh, based upon that one, we have given our orthographic projection. and. Uh, the polygon and other things, the images we have given with respect to the these pixel values, that is our uh, word coordinate values, that is 50, 100, 400, 100, 400, 400, like that, we have given in the previous tutorial. That is according to the word coordinate, these pixels are given. But now, uh, today we will learn uh, how to give uh, viewport transformation. We are, in another way, we are calling it viewport transformation, that is. Uh, uh, orthographic projection this is also the same projection but what is the difference uh, in this one uh, no need to give the uh, pixel values we will give with respect to the window that is orthographic projection window uh, the values will be given to that uh, this is the function we are going to use white gl ortho left right bottom top near value for value the left and right it is actually x-axis or you can say that horizontal direction left is from zero and right is the maximum value and the bottom is uh, uh, vertical direction bottom value and top is the vertical direction the uh, your window size the orthographic projection maximum value and near and far values they are working as the z variables or when we are going to use the uh, three dimensional values they are used now uh, let us start the uh, program in the previous example we have seen uh, with the polygon from the previous tutorial uh, how to draw the polygon this is the polygon we need uh, we are going to draw uh, in this one we have used pixel values but today we will use the reference values the code is given in the description you can download the code uh, let us start the program uh, start the Visual Studio, go to the new project, select empty project, how to set the variable and other things, uh, you can see the previous tutorials. This is uh, our project with Solution Explorer. If Solution Explorer is not coming, you can go to the view and you can click on the Solution Explorer. Your project with some external dependencies and other files will be added. Right click on the project, select add button and select new item. Select C++ file, give some name of your file, add the file. Now go to your uh, code that the code uh, you can copy the code and paste it here if you will see in this code uh, what we have used <coughs> this is gl ortho in this one we are not using the uh, word coordinate values that is pixel values exact pixel values we are using the minimum and maximum value that is 0.0 1.0 is maximum for the uh, right direction 0, 0.0 the uh, bottom one 1 1.0 is the top one in the vertical direction and this is near and far values we need to set minus if you are using that is uh, uh, by default it is minus because uh, in computer we are looking it behind from the uh, screen so it is minus 1.0 this is z value you can change these values also uh, but it depends upon our <coughs> three-dimensional view or uh, this is the same code if you will see uh, the polygon there is no pixel values we have given for the p1 p2 p3 the code we have used gl begin gl polygon this one and in place of uh, 2v what we have used 3f that is we are going to provide the three pixel values that is uh, x y and z because we are using z so we need to provide the z x uh, z value also but z will be 0, 0.0 because this is two dimensional 
graphics so this is 0 0.25 0 0.25 this is with respect to this one that is the first pixel or first vertex will be at 0 0.25 0 0.25 with respect to this one and the next one 0 0.75 0 0.25 in y direction and z is 0 0.75 0 0.75 0 0.0 0.25, 0 0.75, 0 0.00. Okay, so this is 3F. You can see the uh, this polygon function. You can use this polygon function. No need to use the pixel values. If you will see the window size or our word coordinate, this is same. This is 640, 480. That is word coordinate we are using in the form of pixel. But uh, when we are displaying or we are using the projection, actually we are using the reference value in another way sometimes we are calling it viewport transformation or you can say that where to display our image now uh, set the other parameters or external dependencies the same what we did in the previous one go to cc plus plus additional directories we need to add glut and glue file Go to desktop for me glut and glue file is on the desktop include select folder select for the uh, this time we will select for glue file go to the linker button go to general file additional library directory this time we will add library file library select this time we will go for the glue folder glut and glue folder you can download from the first tutorial this tutorial is actually for the beginners we will go for the intermediate and advanced level also right here free glut dot clip glue 32 dot clip apply one thing is remaining that is uh, about the glut and glue dll file copy these two file which is given with you your glut and glue file go to your right click on this one go to the second last option open folder in window explorer and paste this two DLL file here. <coughs> now uh, all the environment variables are set. Everything is okay. Now you can go to the debug button. First it will build, build the solution. Then it will execute the project. Uh, this is our output. We have not given uh, the pixel values but it is displaying the values that is 0.25 with orthographic projection values actually orthographic projection we have set maximum with the word coordinate that is 640 and 480 so by default it will take 0 0.25 0 0.25 at this place <coughs> excuse me so uh, in place of uh, gl ortho 2d uh, or uh, giving the pixel values it is better to give the reference values it will give you uh, the mo more space because it will you can uh, draw your image where you want to draw and how you want to draw you can draw uh, with the help of this function more videos we will uh, upload uh, later uh, the previous video you can watch and you can subscribe the channel for the more videos thank you for watching the channel please subscribe the channel